morning, everyone. Something exciting's happening in the garden. Just, just, just a couple of little things here I want to show you. I believe these are either royal burgundy or purple peacock beans. We have beans coming up. And not only there, but on this guy too. Oh! Isn't that a cute little treat? And then I went and planted some tomatoes and they weren't really coming up so I thought I'd plant more seeds than one. But all of a sudden I have all of these tomatoes coming up in these bunches. <laughs> Look at that. So now I have to take them apart and spread them out and hopefully, <laughs> hopefully they live. I planted those little extras that were on the table over there. So that's an extra one. That's an extra one. And I've heard there's two extra ones down there. And then my peas are actually starting to grab the fence, which is lovely. But yeah, we're gonna have to separate those. individually planted now. My squash is a little bit beat up from the storm last night. They're doing okay too. I need them to start trellising on things. Need them to start trellising. So I'm like kind of a hoarder, but I sent Morgan to go get me a free box of plumbing surprise box filled with a whole bunch of pipes and gadgets and gadgets. So I want to make crafts and have them for things. So I sent Morgan to get it. Okay, so we got a couple, a couple cool things. Some of it's garbage. Like it was free, so whatever, right? This can be easily made into something for hanging plants, hanging your hats, hanging your clothes. 
I could easily attach this to a piece of wood and have it for the girls. Um, this looks pretty new, like, that's a, a nice little find there because when we go to build or renovate our new house, it's an extra piece we got that we don't have to buy. I don't know what these are for, but I'm going to take them out and keep them in these little light switches. This is just like a bucket of bolts and stuff like that. I'm going to have to peek through here and see what's, see what's good. This is for our bath, for the bathroom, for your toilet, I believe. I don't know what these are for. Waste overflow bucket. Oh, that's cool. It rained last night, so the boxes are kind of wet and falling apart, but that's Rings, placement parts kit. Those are all there in a, a different story. There's just like a bunch of little screws. So I'm gonna put that into like a little extra box. Huh. Do you think I can? Post coupler sponge. Oh. bunch of like bits and pieces for shower heads and stuff. Look at that. For the outside hose. So if we ever need something for like if we have a well and the well needs an outside tap hose. There we go. Plumbers go with the flow. <laughs> I need to find a plumber to give this to now because I'm not a plumber but that's cute. Some more odds and ends. Ceiling compounds. Oh, water. But I'll empty it out. It's a bunch of like piping fixtures. I think it's copper. Hey, it is copper. Yeah, or brass. Or brass. That's, that's, I get quite a bit of uh, random, random stuff. vlog I froze eggs in my muffin pans and I greased the sides to see how it turned out and today I took them out and they're awesome they're like little pucks of eggs I put six in each bag so I'm just gonna freeze these in the deep freeze and then take them out as needed so on you cook I'm also doing more um, and I'm gonna bake some cookies today too. But uh, some of them are bad, so I have to do it a certain way to make sure I'm not putting bad ones in so I don't have to dump the whole thing. So I'm gonna do them all like, kinda individually. Cracked over something. They're all mixed spot. Don't mess me, my lab, don't mind me messy up. It's cute sometimes. Cracking. Smell it. It didn't even have anything yellow in it. It didn't even have yellow. That's weird. We're gonna save like four eggs to make cookies with. So we have our four eggs in here. We have these in here. So I keep my eggs in like a big old container like this. But when it gets full, I just kind of take this. And smash it down. This ends up this ends up going into the garden into my plants into the compost and then that's when we add our other egg shells our 
other eggshells. Oh, look at that. Look at that. That's a big freaking jar. I think it's supposed to be for flowers, but Wrap it with plastic wrap and throw it in the freezer for a couple of days. And then we just put it in the freezer, pick it up. Yes. Barely any room in there. Not the organizer. Eggs Don't mind my dirty kitchen. It's gonna be cleanup time. So we're gonna go to the store. We need to grab some things for supper. We're gonna make a stir fry. Me and Nathan need to go foraging for plantains for a stir fry when we get back. So I'll uh, throw this down the road, but still scavenging. So we'll videotape that. Look at my legs. My legs are just dirty. Can you grab my shoes? Uh, yeah. <laughs> and then when we get back, we're gonna do supper and some baking. I can't go on the road. I got this big thing of spinach. Doesn't quite fit in the fridge because it's so big. But I'm gonna chop down a bunch of it for frozen spinach, goes in the freezer for my shakes, and then some fresh stuff for salads or sandwiches. And so. So I'm going to put it in individual handfuls and individual sandwich baggies and then I'm going to place all the sandwich baggies into one big bag so it's kind of together. Put them in the freezer. It doesn't have to be perfect, it's just kind of chopped up a little bit so when it goes into the blender it doesn't have to do too, too much work. Handful of spinach per bag. Roll up the baggie. I like to roll them up some weed. And then place it in there. Yeah.
got our bag of individual spinach bags. We're just gonna seal it. Throw that bad boy in the freezer. <laughs> You're so funny, honey. You're so funny. So I picked up a basil plant and planted it in here. Look at that beautiful stuff. Oh. Full. And then I got a thing of lettuce here and it has roots on it. So I'm gonna I'm gonna plant it in the garden somewhere. I just gotta find a spot that I trust. Maybe over in this corner. Maybe not. I don't know. But I'm gonna plant it. There. All planted. And then we can just pick as we want. Nathan are gonna go and forage some wild young plantain. It's I don't it's not what you think it is, but we're gonna use the leaves for stir fry and I'm going to grind get as much as the seeds as I can to grind it up to make pancakes with. So come with us. So all along here is the wild plantains. We're gonna get the leaves, the roots, the seeds, and they're all along the edge here. So. That's the plantain. It's gonna go into this little bag, shopping bag. And there's a whole field of This is all the plantain. So what Nathan's doing is he's cutting off the top stems of them with the seeds and we're going to dry those out so I can ground the seeds into powder for pancakes. And then we got the, the leaves and the roots here so we're going to take the leaves, wash them, use them for stir fry tonight. Uh, and then freeze the rest and then wash and keep the roots. I think I'm going to dry the roots and use it as spring powder. Yeah. Do you think it's a good idea? Yeah. So we're going to do that and I'm going to charge his phone. So now it's cut. We chop the tops off for seeds. They are washed and they're going to dry. We have uh, washed and cut off the roots which we're going to dry out and the leaves here are going to go some into our stir fry and some into the freezer for whatever we may need to use it for. 
It has a ton of different properties. I'll list some in the description below. Yeah. Yeah, so dad put in the plantain leaves and everything's boiling down really nicely. So like, kind of like bok choy is thinking maybe. General Tao. General, General Tao. Stay tuned guys, I think we'll make a little bit of rice maybe to put on the bottom. Yeah. And then, yeah. I can't see. Looks good to me. Do you like it? Yeah. Isabella, do you like it? No. Okay. That's okay. We got uh, three yeses and a no. So that's not bad. Well, I think that's about it for today's vlog, guys. I'm going to water the garden since it's nice and, and nice and shady now. And, uh, yeah. Thanks for coming along with us.